Today, guys, as you can see, we got the non auction or trade ultimate ticket player pack. What we had to do, we had to get all those milestone collectibles. This past week, I have been grinding out these soul challenges like it's been no one's business. But you know what? We've got that. But also, today, we got new ultimate legends. Oh my god, who the hell cares? So for 635k, you can get your hands on the new Willie McGinnis, 99 overall with secured tackler, edge setter, and edge blitzer chemistry. He's got 92 speed, 96 strength, 94 acceleration, 97 tackling, 97 player egg, 97 block shed, 98 pursuit, and 96 hit power. His catching has got to be something good, am I right? 71, so that's not entirely too bad. I actually do have the NFL Playoffs legend Willie McGinnis because I actually, I actually pulled him out of the fan appreciation packs. Not a bad card, and compared to Nick Perry and, of course, you know him, it it's a good freaking card. The 92 speed, though, for a right outside linebacker, I'm pretty sure we can find a lot better at this stage of month. Can, look at the new DeAndre Levy that came out, the summer blockbuster. That card blows this one out of the water. Also released today, guys, is 99 overall Marvin Harrison with Playmaker, Route Runner, and Chain Mover. And again, another one of these cards where at the end of month, you would think after releasing summer blockbusters, they're going to have to juice this card up a lot. And so... I don't know how to feel about this. He does have actually really damn good stats. 97 speed, 98 catching, 91 elusiveness, 97 spectacular catch, 95 release, 99 route running, 96 catch and traffic, and 96 jumping. Marvin Harrison looking like a pretty damn beast of a wide receiver. But again, if I had to compare him to the new Odell Beckham Jr., the summer blockbuster edition, I mean, Odell is really the better card. He's more juiced up. But these cards are going for around 600 some k They're honestly going for the same price as Ultimate Legends. So, why would you go after an Ultimate Legend when you get Summer Blockbuster? Now, before we get into the non-auction or trade play, we're going to open up a quick pro pack. See what we get. See if we can get something nice out of here. Hopefully, we can get ourselves an elite player. That would be pretty dope. Get a Steven Jackson right there. I cannot believe he's not in the league anymore. Steven Jackson was actually a pretty freaking nice running back. Until I think he just got cut from the Rams or he got traded from the Rams. He was never good since. I know he played for Atlanta. Our last card is going to be an elite and it's going to be a Ryan Khalil elite. So I can only imagine our non-auction or trade players got to be better than this. All right, enough sounding like an idiot. It is time to reveal who we get for the non-auction or trade ultimate ticket player. I'm hoping for something good. If you don't remember, out of the solo challenges we did to get the ultimate ticket player, we got ourselves a Rob Gronkowski. Who do we get today? If we get another Gronk, that would be kind of dickheadish because then I just have another Gronk sitting. So here we go, guys. Without further ado, let's open the pack. Here comes the... Here comes the... Here comes the... Y'all don't really want it like that. Oh, yeah. Here comes the... Oh, no. Here comes the... It's Derek freaking Henry. Okay, you know what? I'm cool with it. Derrick Henry, let's go. 99 overall halfback with battle ready, pick specialist, and mobile blocker. You know what? I'm cool with this. You can actually quick zone for 50,000 coins. Are you serious? You can actually... Yo, quick sells are actually... All right, now, granted, if this was Madden 13, you could probably quick sell for 500,000 coins, but still, Derrick Henry, nice freaking running back. I want to compare him to my current running back, CJ Proce, the 99 overall. These guys are... I mean, jeez, CJ Proce's... He's just killing him. But Derrick Henry, he's good with the chemistries. The chemistries are what makes him good. CJ Pro has got 96 speed, but Derrick Henry's still a glitch at the end of the day. So with Derrick Henry added to the lineup, this is what the team is looking like so far. I mean, the team, I, I've had some pretty nice additions to this team. And I mean, the offensive spotlight players have been amazing. Offense is looking beautiful. Defense is looking just as good good i mean there's some still some spots that we can uh, definitely upgrade i mean mike evans is good but i actually do want the 99 overall i think there's a golden ticket version of him free safety we can actually upgrade in corners i think are a little bit of a weak link at the moment i know Deion sanders is still good that card's gonna be amazing for the rest of the year champ bailey and brennan Carr. i mean we can also do a lot better but either way guys thank you so much for watching if you liked the video go and hit that like button if you want to see more comments for the channel go and hit that subscribe button i'm mark and as always take it easy y'all have a safe one peace I'm not gon' lie, man. I low key laughed at the shit. Started to feel bad a bit. I mean, this game ain't for everybody. Yeah. And we know niggas lie on they dick.